City of Stevens Point Public Policy and General Government Meeting, recorded November 14, 2022. All right, Public Policy, General yes, Government. Please. You're on. <laughs> yeah. Call to order at 7.26 p.m. And Clerk, would you please call the roll? Fischler. Here. Keemer. Here. Christensen. Here. Zarazua. Here. Kneebone. Here. Great. That's a quorum. And item number two is the license list. Um, we just have two. Um, class B beer license for, it looks like, indoor golf, I-N-D-R-G-L-F. And a class A beer and class A liquor license for Imperial Operating, Wisconsin LLC. And those are to take effect November 22nd, uh, 2022. And is, are there any concerns from the police? Uh, there are none. Okay. <laughs> I was looking I'm like, oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then um, are there, um, would anybody like to make a, a motion? I'll make a motion to accept the license list. Okay. Seconded by Zero Zero. All right. And all those in favor of approval, say aye. 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 That is approved. Item number three is Ordinance Amendment 24.03 for downtown open intoxicant exception. And um, just for clarification, is this just um, to give the clerk um, approval for any special events that repeat themselves or every year? Basically, that's what it is. It's just a modification giving the intent of, of what we wanted to do. So anything that's an annual event um, within that district, the clerk can just, it, it's, it's legal. Okay. Um, is there anything to add or any questions, concerns? Okay. I did have a question just about the boundary line on the map. Um, I mean, it seems like it encompasses most of the establishments with liquor licenses, your, who currently have liquor licenses. Um, although, you know, that could expand or change, but I mean, I think if the police- It's the same boundary as it's been. Yeah, yeah. So I just, about how that line was drawn or how that, I mean, because it includes, you know, like sure. the, the lines of downtown are sort of fuzzy, like where it starts- The original to intent uh, was anything that serves alcohol, uh, in that downtown, which generally accepted as the downtown desire yeah. area, was included, and we extended it so you could make it to Piffner Park or Admiral Grant Park. Um, so if you wanted to go to the park and have a lunch or whatever with a, a beer or whatever, you can do that. Um, down this way is the okay. Admiral Grant Park is right down here okay. on, on this end. Yeah, so, but if the police are happy with the boundaries and those boundaries seem to be working and Alder Christensen has, you know, the businesses in his district are happy with that boundary, then, then I'm fine with that. But I could see that maybe there might be desires in the future for that to change, either bigger or smaller or whatnot. So. Yeah, but well, if we get a request, it'll come to the council for right. consideration. Oh, from my understanding, it didn't, it just was, the map was just for a picture. Right. There's no, no changes. changes to that boundary. No. Right. No so. changes. Okay. And is, oh, I don't think we had a, um, does anyone want to make a motion? I would move approval of uh, the ordinance as uh, presented. I'll second. Okay. All those in favor of approval, say aye. 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 All right, and that is approved. And we are adjourned at 7.30 p.m. A video of this meeting is available for viewing on the city's website, stevenspoint.com slash videos.